Welcome back to the local snooze for snooze locals, where we come to snooze to the news. The snooze master is me, Snorin Sam, and I am actually sorry for everybody that has ever had to tolerate my snoring. Thank you. <laughs> I have uh, a really broken nose sometimes. Uh, anyway, we're reading the local paper today, April 12th, 2023, the chieftain of Wallowa County. And who are we, though, huh? All eight of us here? Um, are you maybe a new local? I think maybe. Getting drunk as balls at karaoke with Melinda for the first time? Huh? Maybe one of you uh, is quite possibly a lost local, hitting the beaches of San Diego, letting the cold Pacific salt your toes as you walk your dog. And one of you definitely is my mom. I love you, mom. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, this week's news, you know, it's news. Uh, I hope something makes you laugh in it, like the hilarious sex trafficking article on the front page. But anyway... Let's keep it smooth. Keep it moving. Local news for new locals. <laughs> the first message from our sponsor, the Burnt Biscuit Cafe. This place is a local breakfast bullshit. It's overpriced, overcrowded, and staffed by unmanaged children. And best of all... You don't even know which place I'm even making fun of because every breakfast place here is the same garbage dining experience. Burnt Biscuit, you should have made your own breakfast. <laughs> All right. Front page, human trafficking, uh, a survivor story. Rebecca Bender escaped trafficking. Now she works to stop it. Written by Mike McAnally. Hard-hitting sex crimes are getting the front page. This is going to sell some ads. Anyway, um, Rebecca was a uh, sex trafficked in Las Vegas for six years. She is originally from Grant Pass. She's going to put on two presentations at the Cloverleaf Hall. Uh, I like in the picture she's doing that like one arm across, like with the other arm straight posed. The abuse girls always do in the Lifetime commercials, like with the mean stepdad in the background, and she's like looking out a window, a rainy window. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, <laughs> All right. Well, Alla County Voices featuring uh, Harley. Not is it? Char it's Harley. It's not Charlie. Harley Steen Senior Eyes Future Work with Horses. Horse girls are incurably crazy. FYI, and she, and then by that I mean her dad has six horses. <laughs> the girl with six horses says the housing shortage should be fixed by sending people back to the city. Then Bradshaw, <laughs> Bad Billy, asks her about the new Joseph police force. She's a 17-year-old horse girl from Joseph, so of course she doesn't have an opinion. Uh, when Bradshaw asked her advice for people that want to move here, someone kindly kicked him right in, an old, in his old dick. <laughs> and that's where the article ended. Bottom of the page. Uh, cow gives birth to chiplets. And Joseph, they're all healthy, says owner Jason Dunham. Huh. Good for them. Now, a message from our supporters at Haskins BBQ Sauce. It's no hassle with Haskins. You just pour it on your meat. Quick flip through. For the record, nobody was arrested this whole week. Cool. Huh. Maybe that has something to do with new officer, Shannon Stillman. She just joined the Enterprise PD. I've seen her. I've seen her. Um, ooh, Enterprise girls impressed at first track meet. Good job, guys. Uh county to begin road work in zoom wall area huh. snowpack surges throughout the region hey so unbelievable authorities still investigating a plane wreck that killed two men uh, obituaries no laughing and perkins died 
Dollar Stretcher has three ninety nine cross rib roast and a dollar ninety nine pork chop. Safeway has five ninety seven try tip roast. Boom. That's it. That's the local news, guys. Thanks for listening. I'm Sam. I'll see you next Friday. Mm-hmm.